In Memorial Stadium, where our very own Alyssa Ray is standing by. Alyssa, I knew it would be close, but did you think it would end like this is the question. No, and this is the best ending for a college football fan, not necessarily Duke fans, but if you're sitting at home, this is what you want to see out of a rivalry matchup. Going down to the wire, the first half was a defensive battle. UNC went into the break leading 7-0 in the second half. They exchanged blows, but it did come down to that last drive. UNC up by a field goal. Duke trying to tie the game, if not win it, and two crucial penalties on UNC's defense. First, a face mask, and then a pass interference gave Duke new life. So as you're thinking, UNC defense, you know, I'm sitting here thinking the press game, the post game press conference will all be UNC defense blew the game, but then they got an interception and then UNC sealed the deal. They're celebrating. They're still on the field celebrating. People are taking pictures with their families. The players are out. You should have been on the field when the fans were on it. Big win for the Tar Heels. Obviously, both of these programs are on the up and up and it was a great rivalry game and it's the atmosphere that you want to see when you see these two teams play on the gridiron. Obviously, we know it gets packed for basketball games, but this is perfect for college football. Chris, we'll send it back to you. All right. Thanks a lot there. Let's we'll have more on that game coming Coming up tonight at 11.